Hey everybody, it's your boy Sato Tips aka Marco Polo. We're back with another special video and today we're going to be talking about Gold Miner. This token was recommended by one of you guys, viewers, wanted me to do this video and I'm going to make it for you guys and I'm going to say if this token is a scam or not and we're going to figure out if to this token has some foundations behind it and if it has a potential of 100xing your money. Let's talk about this token, what it does before that. If you guys want to buy this token, it is also a good time because it is negative 5% within the past 24 hours. And that is that means it's on the sale part of this token right now since the market is down. And we could see the volume on this market in the past 24 hours is also down by almost 40% and it's sitting right on the $3 million uh, $3 million volume trading mark in the past 24 hours. And the market cap is actually not... Uh, told in coin market cap so we don't know what the market cap is exactly but we're going to figure it out on their website we're going to do more research and i'm going to show you guys if if you should invest in this token or if it's a scam or not so if you guys are new around here make sure you smash the subscribe button below i'm going to be giving a thousand dollars worth of cryptocurrency away when i hit 2000 subscribers i'm really close to hitting that mark so if you guys want to be entered for the thousand dollars cryptocurrency giveaway make sure you leave a comment in the section below and leave a like on this video and smash the subscribe if you guys are new around here let's get right into the video we could see right now on the graph we could see since let's check the one year graph we could see this token only came out a month ago actually uh, this month november 15 uh it came out and the token has been actually the day it came out it dropped a lot but we could see it went into the red zone and then it just went all-time high in the green zone and it, technically if you bought it in the red zone at all-time low with three zeros in front of it you could have actually and then it went to the all-time high with two zeros in front of it you could have actually 10x your money uh, by buying it at the low and selling it within the next two days but then since then it's been slowly coming down this token hasn't been out for a while so we can't really say if this token is a scam or not but we could see actually you could sell and buy this token because the graph doesn't have that spaghetti noodle thing if you guys are around new around here usually when I say that is when a token is a scam and it's only we could see the graph going up in a positive way and we don't see any downfalls but as we could see here we could see a couple drops here and there but we don't see any rug pull like token like it just suddenly goes up but we could see one big one right here but it didn't crash right after it we could see it had a stability and then it just started dropping just like any other coin that starts dropping especially when the token is just hyped in a few days a matter of hours especially influ influencers do a lot of these hype tokens for cryptocurrencies that come out recently and we could see currently it's been in the red zone and it hasn't gone in the in the green zone for the past pretty much week uh, versus the week before that prior and let's go check their website out right now and see what this token really does and we could see gold miner it's a gaming uh, inter farm that you mine you can mine cryptocurrency and about gold miner gold miner is a play to earn the, the so small third person shooter gold playing game the uh, the user goal is to increase the aiming hit rate and equip the character with a unique NFT to help character increase the game output. Uh, combine DeFi collection and your own personal, uh, personality. Let's check their white paper right now and see what all this token is really about. Full Miner is a free to play third person shooter NFT game where everyone can start playing without the need to pay. Gold Miner is also employs the play to earn model to reward players with tokens and equipment through the dynamic of gameplay. Participation in PvP tournaments with this seamless combination of DeFi and P2E models. Gold Miners gives players the opportunity to play and earn rewards at the same time to create friendly environment for players who are unfamiliar with cryptocurrency market and NFTs. A, a mechanism and called crypto play against uh, is encrypted into the gameplay to give incentive to such players to do their own research and learn about the market. So as I was right, you do play this token and you do get NFTs and cryptocurrency in return. And we're going to see how many percent that is. That, that was the introduction and the vision. Most NFT games uh, currently suffer from an issue, low player base. Many of them don't even have published their 
metrics, for example, monthly active users, MAU, or daily active users. Before exploding, the popularity even of Exile Infinity only had a MAU of 7,200 as of October 2020. So they've had a 7,200 since as of October 2020 of players. The root cause is expensive initial cost for a new player to take part in the game. They have to pay upfront a large sum of money to acquire NFTs before actually playing the game and being able to earn back their initial spending. As a result, most of the players, those games are spectaculars rather than players. Uh, spec so pretty much what they're saying is a lot of these tokens that are out there with games and for you to get your NFTs, you need to pay a big sum of money for you to actually win some NFTs, but the game is not out there. But what they're doing that, they're changing this whole concept of it. Uh, the white paper, per the white paper, Purpose, a seamless combination of both fee to play, play to earn model where every every player, every child, every children can enjoy the game while creating value and making the play to earn model true to its name by minimizing the need of high initial cost. Players can reach can participate in various activities in actions such as selling in game drops, such loot boxes and resources in, on marketplace. So anything you do find in this game, you could sell it on their own marketplace. For cryptocurrency or NFTs in return, minting game characters into NFTs and putting them in auction or rent out the other players. Winning a predator tournaments and events hosted by gold hosted by gold miner game studios, taking their GM token and NFTs to obtain exclusive access to prefer pre preferential terms, new projects from the menu that pops up. Give your project a name and you are good to go. So that's pretty much this is what this token is all about. We're going to go back on the website and see what is the percent return. We could see it's a uh, the token supply is currently 100 billion dollar GM tokens is out there and we could see the farm is 30% and a 20% public and a 15% private, 7% liquidity locked and a 20% ecosystem, the eco development and 3% marketing. So the 100% of the money that is split up like this this is how it's going to be so the first 50 percent is going to farm public and the next uh almost 50 percent is for eco development game ecosystem and liquidity lot and three percent is left for marketing so that's how much they're using for marketing we could see this is their nft collection uh if i'm not wrong and this is their gameplay social marketplace that they're coming out with factory to purchase and supported by actually this token is also audited by Certix. It's also on Pancake Swap, Token Pocket, Coin98, Dig Dig Game, uh, DeFi Pet, uh, Game FI, Trust Wallet, even by Trust Wallet and Binance Smart Chain. One of the biggest ones are the Certix, Trust Wallet, and Binance Smart Chain and Pancake Swap itself. These tokens are really hard to get their names on those websites. And we could see their team, they animated them and they put their name here, Van Hoy, Avan, and Victor, and Bella Ruskin. That's really cool of the way they did it, and they animated the founders, and they're audited by Certix. As I was right, Certix is one of the hardest to get yourself verified, especially as a new token. I don't see a, this any red flags with this token so far, and let's go check their Twitter account. Their Twitter account has actually 61, right over 61,000 followers. This is a really to good token. We could see a lot of good foundations on it. And I could see this token act easily 10xing in the next year. And we could see they're updating their fans on their website, on their Twitter page, and keeping engagement high. A 61,000 follower fan base within the, within the month is really strong that you could tell that this token has no scam. So right now is a really good time to purchase this token even though it's in a red zone. This video was no, uh, not at all sponsored or paid sponsorship. This is just by my own research doing it and saying this token could have some potential, but make sure you always do your own financial research before investing. And if you guys are new around here, make sure to don't forget to hit the subscribe button below. And I'll see you guys in the next one. I hope you enjoyed it. Peace.